is Bob Hill, Chair of Lake Oswego Veterans Memorial. We were founded uh, three, three and a half years ago to construct a veterans memorial park for our uh, veterans and our first responders. We thought today on Veterans Day would be a good day to do the groundbreaking ceremony. So uh, we're honoring all of our veterans that served in the United States Armed Forces, past, present, and in the future. My name's uh, Captain Jonathan Puskis. I am the Master of Ceremonies for today's Veterans Day events in Lake Oswego. I have been in the United States Navy for the past 25 years. Uh, I'm currently the Reserve Deputy Commander of Coastal Marine Group 1 based out of Imperial Beach, California, which is in San Diego. Veterans Day is absolutely one of my favorite holidays. It's a day, unlike Memorial Day, where we take a moment to reflect on those who have paid the ultimate sacrifice. Veterans Day is the day we get to celebrate all those who have raised their hands and taken an oath to support and defend the Constitution United States. Hi, I'm Alex Runyon. I'm a Marine Reservist and I was invited here today to talk about um, what it means to me to be a veteran. Uh, my brother Michael, uh, younger brother, served as an Army Infantry Officer and uh, he deployed in July of 2010. Michael was two weeks into his deployment. Uh, it was, I believe, his second time out on a convoy and their unit was attacked by a roadside bomb. He was struck and fatally wounded. Um, he survived the initial blast, but uh, the injuries were, were too much to sustain and died a few hours later. I honor him by, you know, I feel like if you keep talking about people and you keep sharing how they inspire you and how they've changed your life, um, they're always with us and they never really go away. And that's how we remember and, and honor those who have had that impact in our lives. I'm so proud to, to call him my brother and I say, while he was still with us, I, I felt like as the older brother to be an example for him and lead the way. And when I look back, I realize how much I learned from him in watching him live the way that he lived. So I hope to honor him by, by continuing to live in that way to, to keep his legacy alive. The memorial is important to me and others. We want to honor the people that serve, especially those that uh, live here in Lake Oswego, or close ties to that. We now have enough funds to start uh, construction. The city's working hard on doing that. Hopefully a ribbon cutting ceremony is somewhere in the future. That may be Memorial Day.